What's going on guys? We're talking about baseball bats today and we're going to go over the difference between a USSA bat and a USA bat. So Mason, do you use this one for Little League? Yes. Okay, so this one we, we'll start with the Little League bats, aka the USA bats. So when you're looking for a bat for, you know, a Little League organization, you know, your typical leagues that you find all over the place in the United States, it's going to have a stamp with a USA bat. If you guys can see that right there. So that means that you can use this in Little League. Um, and you know you, you could use it in USSA and stuff like that too. But you can't do vice versa. So with the USA bats, you get a 2 and 5 eighths barrel. So a little bit smaller of a barrel versus a USSA bat. And they're usually uh, weighted a little bit differently. Like this one's a drop 12. This is a 27 drop 12. So it's it's pretty well it's a it's a balanced bat and you can see that it has a much smaller smaller barrel than what you'll see typically on a USSA bat. So the USA bat very you know very good bat, not as much pop as the USSA bats, and I'll explain why. Some some of the barrels and, and materials that they use for USSA or is a little different, so a little bit more pop, right? Mm -hmm. You feel like this one has less pop than, than your Cat 9 yeah. composite? I'm, I'm not composite. This is an alloy. Um, so this one too. Here, hold this one. This one is another USA bat right here. Um, and this is a 26-inch bat. And you can see the barrel taper. See the barrel on that? It's very a lot smaller than a typical uh, USSA bat. And, you know, a 2 5 eighths barrel. This is a speed, Eastern speed. Good entry level bat that Mason used his first season, yes. and then he went to that one. Um, what do you think of this one when you use it? It's a good bat. Yeah, it was a good bat. I hit it in the outfield. Okay. And you know he liked this bat. It's a good for you know entry level little leaguer. Um, you know, and they have a bunch of other options, obviously. Um, so then we'll go to you triple SA bats. So this is a Cat 9, this is a travel ball bat, basically U trip any organization that has U-Triple-S-A. Um, and this one, obviously you can see the taper in the barrel is a little, it's, it's fatter, it's a two and three fourths barrel. So bigger barrel, you can kind of see that already. And you know, has a different texture, a lot more pop in these, um, you know, obviously it's, it's all about the swing and the mechanics of the, of, of the swing, but you know, having a better, more uh, capable barrel and more pop in the back definitely helps out. So, you know, obviously this one has the 1.15 be the barrel. Um, so this one definitely um, has more pop. What do you think, Mace? Yeah. Do you like this one a little bit better? Yeah. Hit it a little harder with this one? Yeah. Sounds it a little. Has a big barrel. Bigger barrel. Feel a little bit more confident with this one? Yeah, I yeah. feel like I can hit it. Hit it a little farther with this one? Yeah. So he really likes the Cat 9 composite. This is probably his favorite bat. I always say the composite, it's not a composite. It's an alloy. Um, the Cat 9 here, he likes the alloy versus the composite. The composite, um, especially for a, um, a smaller K that doesn't have a lot of power, I feel like an alloy is a little bit better. It's a little bit more forgiving on the hands. You can miss it and get a little bit more out of it rather than the composite. So um, yeah, we just wanted to go over the difference between uh, USA, yeah, USA and U Triple USA bats, right? Yeah. So thanks for watching. Hope you see us in the next video. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace Please subscribe. Out. Peace out.